Yeah, that looks really good. So the walls are smooth now, and now that means they can be painted. Yay! It only took, uh, what, three months to get to this point? That's just because I took a really long time to get all the wallpaper off, not because it needed to be that long. We're also going to paint that back wall the same green color so the stairs will sort of be offset. The white trim will pop. <clears throat> this is Faro and Ball's green smoke. Smoke green. Smoke green. Yes. Yeah. Which you can get at Sherwin-Williams. They have a bunch of the Faro and Ball colors there. Well, you can, you can ask me to paint match it. Yeah, they can paint match it. But you they don't have, have to like color loaded in their database. Yes, you don't have to take a sample in or anything like that. So if you find a Pharaoh and Ball color that you like, you can go to Sherwin Williams and ask um, if they have it in their database. Because not everyone has Pharaoh and Ball stores in their hometown. Actually, very few people do. Sadly, it's very sad. So there it is. Ta-da! <laughs> Five minutes later, this is our progress update. So we're also doing this like around the inside of the stairwell. Yeah, so it's just like an accent wall, but there's sort of a lot to the accent wall. Mm -hmm. There's this section all done. It looks so pretty. That's gonna look very nice. I'm standing at our front door right now. So this is the first thing you see when you walk into our house. So that's going to look very nice. Um, and I think we're gonna keep the rest of these walls white because there's not a whole lot of natural light <clears throat> in here. So we don't wanna make it too dark. And then we'll put some kind of, I don't know, something there. I'm thinking some kind of uh, coat rack or hooks or something for guests so that they have somewhere to put their coats and purses and shoes and all that when they come in. Um, our cuckoo clock goes on that wall, right there on that screw. <laughs> um, yep, and then we might put a bench or something here or some kind of plant stand or something. I don't know yet. It's coming together though, slowly but surely. Paint update, wall paint update. 30 minutes, later. <laughs> 30 minutes later it looks so good doesn't it look pretty although my only complaint is that it now really highlights the popcorn ceiling because before the ceiling just blended into the white walls but now it is super duper obvious so we're gonna have to do something about that because it doesn't really go with the um, classical traditional vibe we're going for here it gives off more of a Hey, I was made in the 80s vibe, which we would like to avoid, so. Popcorn ceilings really give off any, I don't think they were intended to give off any vibe. <laughs> oh, they give off the vibe, for sure. Yeah. They came into existence out of convenience, not out of, uh, not out of aesthetic. inspiration. Yeah. Well, I'm inspired to um, unpopcorn them. That's where I'm, that's where my inspiration's at. Anyway. Looking good.